Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. Force here, continuing our playthrough series of The Elder Scrolls III Morrowind. Well, last we left off, we just, uh, we just got the key to this lower level here in this dungeon. And I wanted to end the video last time, because I felt like this... I don't know if it's going to be the case, but I felt like there was a lot to explore down here. And I kind of wanted to wait for another video, just because the last video was already pushing like 40 or 50 minutes. Alright, so, we are down here, uh, we haven't really looked much at all, so why don't we go ahead. I'm gonna start off by checking down over here to the left, and we're gonna want to keep an eye here on the little map. This is diverging a little bit from the main quest, but you know, that'll happen. Uh, as always, thank you all for your suggestions, I got the tip to, what the heck, you're like translucent. I got the tip to um, select the use best attack. So that's what I'm doing. I'm using the best attack. Force, what are you talking about? It's like this option here. Let me show you here. So yeah, always use best attack is what it's uh, it's what it said. Also, people are asking me the difficulty. I'm just playing at the the moderate. It's like the the default difficulty, basically. Not super easy, not super hard. Just the default. I don't know. It sounds like good to me. <laughs> For the sake of what we're doing here, it sounds perfect, to be honest with you. All right, so we're gonna collect some of this stuff here and uh, continue along. Oh, we'll there's summon skeleton. Someone scared and there's nothing down over here. No. All right, why am I not running? First and foremost, going about two miles per hour. No, thank you. You want me a door? Where do you lead? Is this the one? Is this the same? Yeah, I think this is the air. Okay, so that's where we went before. All right, just trying to get my bearings here, guys. Bear with me. Ha 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 ha. And uh, is there anyone over here? Yes, there is. This dude. Look at that. Smacked in the face. Made you d d d d disappear. Alright, let's, <laughs> let's take a look here around. See what we got. A whole lot of nothing, really. This thing will not reveal to me its secrets. Reveal your secrets! I'll try shouting at it louder next time. A tube? I'll take a tube. An ornate chest, uh, hammer, sure. Starts to get weighed down, I'll grab that. Ancient door key, yeah. I'll take that. Eh. 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 Check the table. Anything? Yeah, sell them Stormer coins. Those things are so awesome. They weigh like nothing and they're worth a billion. Nothing on these shelves, though. They're terrible shelves. No, oh, no. No, thank you. All right, well, this area over here is uh, pretty small. Pretty short little roundabout, really nothing doing here. I don't think I missed any secret passageways, so. Well, that's good. The left side doesn't apparently have much. We'll go back to the right side. I was just hoping to find some sweet treasure down here. Which I don't know if that's going to happen or not, but, um. No, oh, no. Are you just trapped forever? Okay, there you go. Let me uh, quickly string a healing myself a little bit. There you go, you got it. You got it, I believe in you. I think you got one more in you. There you go, all right. Come on. And there's some uh, some shenanigans going on. Look at that thing, rolling around. Look at him. Look at him. This doesn't go anywhere, does it? No. Look at this thing, he's a little ball. Oh, cute. Come here, die. You die. Give me treasures. Ah, God, the stupid stuff. It weighs way too much. It's not worth that much. Okay, well, at least, oh boy, this is just, I can see nothing. 
I don't know if I can see nothing. You guys can see even less than nothing. So we'll get out of this nothing seeing area in just one second. Okay. Get out. Nope. You. Damn it. You. Blah. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> nothing seeing area has been left. And it looks like we uh, pretty much saw everything there was to see there. So. Let's go down to the deep ore passage. Hey, yo. Hey, you. I know you're resistant to magic. You're not resistant to hammer to face, though. No one is. That's not worth it. Oh, yeah. Look at these places. Look at this thing. for me still. I hate you. I can't rest still. Going to the darkest of the darkest dungeons. You can't see anything down here. Except for this guy. I can see him. Oh. This guy's formidable. Still can't rest, huh? It's ridiculous. I keep running back here. We can keep spamming T and running until I can eventually rest. I'll rest eventually. Come on, let me rest. Oh, there's no one. There's no one that close to me. You're being silly. No one is that close to me. Just let me. Are you really gonna make me go all the way in the other room to rest? Really? Unbelievable. Well, here we are. We're rested. And we're feeling good. Back to whence we came. This is a pretty cool dungeon. Lots to see. Also, lots of creepy... Oh! Where are you? I see you. That's a lie. There you are. Are you dead? You're not dead. Are you dead? Can I loot your, there you go, there's your cytoplasm. <laughs> hey, buddy. Glad I killed that fool. Was that the last of them? That, was, that should be the last enemy in my vicinity. Down here we got some waterways. See much of anything down here. So we go for fresh air. Mm, that's good. Whew. It's getting a little claustrophobic down there. All right, nothing, anything over here. Now just a random bridge. The bridge to nowhere is what they call that. And this is the nowhere area. I don't believe this. I don't believe this for one bit. Is there a door up there? Let's put this away for a second. I just want to confirm here. Oh! What's this? Oh, there's nothing. Damn it! Why could you not be a super secret passage? How disappointing is that? There can't really be nothing. What? what? That's not normal. Oh, oh shucks. This, uh, uh oh. Um, as, as cool as I'd like this to be, this is not what's supposed to be happening right now. I am in a place that I should not be. Well, luckily I was able to clip through the wall and <laughs> And make it to some place I should be. Okay, so there is no doors. I see nothing. No! No, I'm trapped again! Get out! Oh, I failed myself. 
and all of you. I don't remember how I got up. Just please, just keep jumping. I'm looking at myself at a different light here. Come on, you go up there. Just, just keep. No, I need you to keep. This is not what I need you to be doing. <laughs> oh, I hate this. What was that? I thought I saw something that I could like activate. Was that just my? That's probably just my breath popping up. Okay. okay. Shenanigans. Shenanigans. Oh, Lord, I'm gonna have to edit this crap out. Edit magic. Wow. Well, that was super annoying. I'm getting the heck out of this place before I fall through something else. All right, well, um, unfortunately enough, it appears like there's just not much to be done here. I don't see any doors. Looks like there might be something to, I can't tell though. We're just gonna, I'm just gonna get out of here. We're gonna go back to the main quest. This, this, this whole exploring this dungeon proved to be not worth it. Unfortunately enough, I was hoping for some super riches or something. Could there be something up there? Yeah, potentially. But, I really wanna, Okay, so there's a spider up here. Oh. What? Die. You. Alright, this is just silly. Thank you much. Alright, so, we killed that thing now. We got this over here. What's inside? Please be something worth... Are you kidding me? That's gotta be the stupidest reward I've ever seen! Time to get out of here. Forget this place. Well guys, I was hoping for some grand adventure. Or some super awesome reward at the end, but I kinda just feel gypped. Be honest with you. Kind of just feel a bit gypped. And maybe that's my fault for expecting too much of that lower level. The only thing I can think of is if I could somehow manage to jump my way up to the top level, but I didn't even see any doors from anywhere, so. Maybe they existed. I just didn't know. Maybe I'm running around in circles, kind of feels that way. Oh my lord, are you kidding me? It feels exactly that way. <laughs> just, get me, just get me out of here, please. Is this the one? Up is good. I like going up. Promising. Aha, yes. Okay, wonderful. All right, so we're gonna get out of here. Um, yeah, I was I was hoping for some super grand adventure, but evidently not. We're gonna get out of here. We're gonna go back to town, and once we're there, head in the mage guild uh, as we try to go make our way back to the main quest line. Basically, is my plan here. Um, let me know if there's something in there I missed. By the way, I'll I'll go there in my free time. I won't waste any more of your times with that dungeon. But uh, anyways, quest here, quest, quest, quest. So, we're on, uh, we're gonna do this one here. So I need to talk to Sharn Gra Mazgav at the Balmora Mages Guild to learn more about Nera, Nerev Arene. 
Air of Varine. And I'm gonna have to do a little errand for him before he's willing to help me out. Cause he's a jerk like that. So I'll just go ahead and make our way right on over. We're very close now to Balmora. Go to the Major's Guild, find that dude. Do his bidding. Kinda take it from there. I'm jumping. Oh lord, I'm hurting myself. Jump, 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 jump. Look at that, awesome. It's worth it. Oh you guys, it's worth it. Bam jump like this, level up your acrobatics or whatever. Maybe eventually I'll be able to jump to the moon. I don't want to do that quite yet, though. No. All right, so here we are in town. Again, we're gonna make our way to a little mages guild area right next to the fighters guild. And um, actually, you know, I'm gonna hmm, no, do that some other time. All right, let's, let's just go do that. Let's focus on that there. Try to keep this uh, main storyline keep it going. Here we go. Alright, so what's the name of the fool that I need to speak to? Hurry this up, will you? Calm down. Alright, Sharn, Gramazab, Muzgab, and talk about Naravine. Sharn, Gramazab, talk about Naravine. That's not where I go. My time is precious, so you are not him. Are you down here? You must be. Yes, Naravine, tell me. Errand, there we go. Okay, the errand is very simple. I need the skull of what? Come on, you'll find it at the ancestral tomb, but take care not to upset the natives. The Darmir, particularly primitive bridges against necromancy. Okay, so let's see here. I need to go kill that person. And he's going to be in this tomb. Okay, so the tomb south of this place, just off the road. South of Pe Pelagate, where the heck is that? I don't know where Pelagate is, just off the road. Uh. Just before you reach the fork where the road goes southwest towards Sidonine and southeast to Vivek, you may need an enchanted blade. Some spirits are immune to normal weapons here. Take the old short sword. Maybe these scrolls with you. Okay. To the south of Pelagade. How can you tell me where Pelagade is? Let's give us a shot. Do I know where Palegate is? I wonder if that's just a major town that I'm able to fast travel to. Oh, there we go. Pelagade, right there. Okay. So let me see if I can take the uh, fast travel dude to it. And if not, I'll try the... I guess I should have tried the mages. What the heck is going on? I'll try the travel here at the mages, just in case that this is the way to do it. I do know that's right around here. Here's that lady. There she is. Can we hurry this do you bring me to that place? No, you do not. Okay. Let me try my other friend. My other travel buddy. Who is right over here? jump to. On the east. Get out of my way. Those are strange stairs. Look at that. You gotta take a mighty step there on that first level. It's gonna be tough for some short people. 
We yeah. make a special trip just for All right, can you take me to my place here? Man. You cannot. Well, how, how close can you take me? Dren Plantation, Vivix. I guess if I just go to Cedanine. Can you take me? To, I doubt you could take me to the Dren Plantation. Can you take me to. Okay, so just take me to Cedanine, whatever. That's fine, close enough, I guess. We'll just go with this. Where would you like to go? Um, nowhere with you. And then we're just gonna head north in that direction. We get here. The end of this to morning here. There we go. Looks great. All right, so gonna go ahead, head up in this direction. And try to find this place. Just before the fork, where the uh, fork between Cedanine and Vivek is where this place is, just before that fork. So, and it says south, just just south of Pelagate or whatever. Look for an ancestral tomb. Okay, so that is the place. The ancestral tomb is just south for the fork of Vivek and Sidonin. So shoot, I'm get, I hope it's on this road or near it at least. Oh, this is it. All right, awesome. Ancestral tomb, here we go. Get a good place to save, I'd say. And uh, she said some things are immune to... Well, apparently he is not immune to... <laughs> apparently that guy's not immune to my hammer. this stuff yeah nah or donate to receive a blessing sure what's my blessing oh oh well, give me uh I don't know give me restoration what the hell that even means <laughs> someone tell me what just happened can I check my stats? Anything fancy happen? No, 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 I can't really tell. Now, let's see here. Take a look at the map. Go to local. Looks like this is just a normal door. Ah! Ah! I'm stuck! Or I just got stuck in the doorway. Come here. You come to me. Look at these creatures, he's got bones sticking out of his face. Holy heck. That is creepy. This guy, skeletal uh, archer. Apparently likes to use his bow and arrows in a close range, that's fine. Do what you will, dude. <laughs> All right, that's fine, I don't really care for that. You are my friend, skeleton, so I don't have to worry about you. That is a pit that I will not go down. Thank you very much. This thing is freaky as heck, oh my. Lesser bone walker, gross, dude. Those bones sticking out of his face, it's no bueno. Can't rest here, enemies nearby. I feel like there's someone in there. There you are. <laughs> uh, funny. What is this thing? How much? Yes, please. It's like kneeling post. That is worth a heck of a lot. Lordy. It's in the urn. 
Nothing much. Alright. So, go over here. Is there anything? No, I went there. I went through that door. Still got all that stuff over there. Let's go down this way. Ah! Ah! <laughs> Oh, oh! Yeah! They did a mighty bit of damage before, uh, biting the dust there. A little worrisome. Let's rest until healed, please. Nothing in those. Small chest. That is not worth much. It's in the chest. Some gold. Which I will take, absolutely. Keep getting these stupid things. Another chest. Eh. Guess I'll take that. Repair prongs. Is that... I wonder how that differs from the other repair tool. Alright, let's, uh... Oh my. Is this just a normal door? Yes, it is. Oh my. What's that other door? Huh. I don't like listening to creepy noises. And I'm hearing creepy noises. <laughs> oh, these urns are so uneventful. Leave that open, just uh, it's a reference so that I know that I have opened that. All right, one thing at a time. Wow, I just killed my own damn skeleton. Oh, I did damage on the least. Oh! Are you ready? Bone beast! Ooh! Dagger of Judgment! There's the skull. Pretty sure that's the skull for the quest. Let me confirm that here. Skull of Levul and Drano. Yeah, that's it. All right, awesome. Quest complete. Take that thing. Check some of these things and uh, finish up here in the dungeon. Uh, medium helm, weight four, armor rating 26. Yeah, I'll take that. Ready. Ooh yeah, that looks smexy too. Guess I'll just grab this stuff. Cause why not? Oh, that is nice. Oh yeah, guys, I also got this amulet of slow fall here. I got that uh, off off camera. I was making a holiday update video right before I left for Christmas and uh, just went through the small little dungeon, found that wonderful thing. So I've got some slow fall amulet. I'm sure that'll come into play. It's going to be a useful tool at some point. Well, we found the skull. See that little creepy noise there? Very strange. All right, I think we, uh, oh, I think we did it. I think we done it. Got everything we needed. I'm super stoked about that helm. I mean, I still look stupid in third person, but <laughs> I do like the way the helm looks despite that. All right, well, that is a, uh, that is a great, great, 
Create an ancestral tomb here. I thought he said some guys were resistant to, or maybe it was just certain types of weapons in mine. I guess my weapon does do magic damage on hit too, so maybe that's kind of what saved me there. Yeah, that's, I know what that is. All right, well, uh, yeah, I think that's everything here in this tomb. Fantastic. Awesome. All right, we'll just go back to Cedanin and we'll take uh, take that little silt strider back to uh, back to where I need to go. We'll be ready to rock. Get out of my way. There we go. We'll go this way. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Look at how little of Morrowind I've actually uncovered. Oh boy. This is gonna take forever. <laughs> well, I'm still gonna be trying to work to do uh, about a video a day at a, at a, you know, roughly half hour's length. Sometimes more, sometimes less. Hopefully just sometimes more. And I'm gonna also try to, uh, as I've talked about before, focus on the main storyline. Which I think will make everything a, a bit easier. At least for the sake of these videos, if I'm focusing on the main storyline, I think that should be pretty darn good. Let's go turn this in, find out what our next objective is, and then we can go from there. That's just, that's too silly looking for me to even handle. Alright, so, dude, I got his skull, which is weird that you asked me for, but I have it. Complete. All right, very good. Now, just take this skull from you. Do, 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 perfect. All right, I'll go to questions. Never mind. Go ahead. Okay, any questions? They believe the long dead hero Nerevar will be reborn to honor ancient promises to the tribes. According to a legend, the prophesied Nerevarin will cast down the false god of the tribunal temple. Hmm. Destroy the traditional ancestor worship practice. Drive all the. Okay, awesome. All right, well, we have the notes we need. We're gonna go bring it back to no, sh no shirt dude, my spy informant. And we'll do all of that in the next episode. Thanks guys for watching. Tune in for more Morrowind adventures coming up very soon. Hopefully about one a day until we finish this game. Thanks for watching. If you like the content, please subscribe. And as always, keep watching and keep owning. Where's no shirt dude? He's back here. <laughs>